patients actually come in with English speaking family members. And I think we kind of use that as a crutch sometimes and we just talk to the family member that speaks English and then they'll communicate to the patient. But I try my best in every situation that I come across to utilize the translators. I think they're very underrated and very underutilized. And so even if there is an English speaking family member with the patient, I think it's very, very important to utilize translators because at that point, you're talking directly to the patient with the assistance of a translator, but you're, you're getting across exactly what you want to say because these translators are trained and you're getting the answers catered to your questions. And so I think making that a very, very big habit and practice and not just using family members that speak English as part of the communication really helps.